guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl star flames and in this video we're gonna talk about a report that i came across that is saying that the kardashians are reportedly nervous about what is going on with kanye's alleged marriage to bianca sensori listen guys these kardashians they need to you know have several seats providing that this report is factual and i'm not talking about a report from a month ago few weeks ago no i'm talking about a most recent report that i came across now these kardashians need to remember that they have bigger problems than what is going on with ye west and bianca sensori because travis scott walked out on kylie travis is out there playing golf living his best life not even thinking about the mother of his two kids we have kendall that keeps getting cosmetic procedure because guess what she wants to be the prettiest girl on the runway but that girl looks as though she has several pieces of board stuck in her cheek and in her forehead that she cannot even give a good head turn anymore listen you people have more mess than what any sewage department can clear at this time and it's really disgusting to see that there are reports that they aren't sure if it's a PR stunt. They're waiting to see files or people. They're real nervous because the children are involved and the kids are the major part of their family. Yada, 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 yada. Right? They're talking about, you know, how they marry the theory behind Bianca's and Ye's marriage, right? No, the Kardashians have more problems than what Ye has, if you really think about it, because they are depending on their kids at this point for clout and attention. Kim, the major one. So I believe that what they're saying is basically, is it that Kanye is going to file a petition in the court to have North removed from social media? Because every time we hear that the Kardashians are concerned about, are nervous, this time they're saying nervous, right? It's given the sense that the main concern and the main focus has always been around the kids and not the kids' well-being. But they're always just throwing the kids in there, you know, to make it seem as though they really care. Now, they're saying that. You know, with all the controversy that has surrounded Kanye West over the past few months, many were caught off guard by the news of the disgraced rapper had apparently entered into marriage with, with just two months after his divorce from Kim Kardashian. Now, if Ye is a disgraced rapper, so many people cannot be concerned about someone, you know, that has been given the title of a disgraced individual. A disgraced individual is someone that everyone has cut ties with, no one is talking about, no one is caring about. So that's another fallacious attempt against Ye's legacy right there. But guess what? You know, the black community today, we're not like our ancestors. We don't know how to sit and turn the other cheek. We're going to fight back. And we're not just going to fight back. We're going to provide evidence that he's not a disgraced rapper. And that title is just for the lame and the pity. Those who have nothing valuable of themselves. So guess what? We can't stand to see another black man's success because we can never ever be creative enough to be half of what Ye West is or has achieved. So guess what? They basically want to strip him of these titles, but it will not work, right? But let's get back to this entire mess of the Kardashians, you know, being concerned. This is called, you know, the media outlet is called Cinema Blend. The Kardashians have way too much problems of their own at this point to be concerned about someone else's yard. They need to go clear up their backyards because Kim cannot get a man, and if she gets one, she cannot keep him. The only one that has a stable um, relationship is Courtney, and she's keeping all of them at bay because Courtney knows that they're cursed. Courtney knows that once her mom and sisters are involved in her marriage, 
Travis Barker is going to go left. And she doesn't want that. She wants to stay happily married. So Courtney is blocking them all just as all Beyonce and Jay-Z blocked Kim Kardashian's ass out. Listen, people may say a lot about Jay-Z and, and Beyonce, but there's one thing for sure is that they saw what Kim was coming with. Ye couldn't see it because he was blindly in love with this narcissist. But no, it is all being exposed. Now, let's talk about Kendall. Kendall, this we don't know if Kendall is going or coming. It seems as though she has been caught in the cycle of looking dead. Have you guys seen Kendall on the runway lately? <laughs> like, Kendall looks as though she was spray starched and ironed out. She's so stiff. Her face looks frightening. And I mean, if you look at Kendall before the procedures and Kendall after, those are two different persons, like two different people you're looking at. While Kendall still looks beautiful and still posing practically nude on Instagram like a fish stick, she's not, definitely not appealing. So no man will want to stick around. She's a model but she doesn't look appealing. I don't know how she even got in the ranks of, you know, the top model, but I mean, with the Kardashians, who knows? She worked halfway for it and the other half was given to her because of entitlement. Now, Kylie is acting though she's a mad woman. Kylie's wearing a noose necklace. She's wearing a lion's head. You know, the family's just a hot mess at this time. They're in no position to be concerned about anything else other than their own affairs. Kim is on TikTok making TikTok videos using her product, but her product cannot touch her, touch her forehead. She cannot use her, her complete product from its original packaging in any of her tutorials because she knows that that shit ruins her skin but she wants other people to be out there using the entire product listen i've never seen the entire line working for anyone and i've been paying attention there might be one product from the line that truly works but not the combination itself and she knows it that's the reason why she's listen guys go on kim's tiktok page you'll see kim kardashian showing off her product saying she's doing a facial cleanse but a forehead did not even get a drop of water because she couldn't afford such damage but people are out here buying this you know narcissist product so i'm just saying that you know really thanks for your concerns kardashians but you have more problems than even your your last name can keep up with at this point. We have Chloe out here that is trying to sabotage Jordan Woods. Chloe allegedly pay, paid this woman to buy Jordan clothes, trashed her products. While this woman had the same return policy for her online store, and Chloe gave her a major, you know, she gave her that part of being good America's, you know, fluffy model. Listen, I'm not even going to talk about that girl because when you look at her standing, you don't know if she's going or you or coming. And she's in no position to be trashing anyone's products or anyone's business reputation. And it shows that Chloe is just so weak, like... Tristan's mom has passed. She is still mourning the death of Tristan's mom because Andrea always said that Chloe is her daughter because she doesn't have a daughter. So she took Chloe as her daughter. She had an amazing relationship with Chloe based on what I've learned. But still yet, Chloe is just a narcissist because really no one is buying her products like they used to. And everyone is just tired of this family so what are you talking about being concerned like you guys have more mess than any state department can clear up at this point so focus on your life don't focus on you because you is good right so really guys that's really all i want to share in this video because we all know what that article is saying already and because kim did not get that result that she wanted over the weekend and everyone is dragging her ass they're coming back with more stuff. And I told you guys that they're going to keep going after you because they cannot 
use Ye's creatives anymore because many of them were um, a part of Bianca's designs. So guys, that's really it. That's all I want to share in this video with you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care. And remember to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay blessed. See you all next time. Bye, guys.